guys, it's Amanda. So let me just start off by saying I've had some technical difficulties with this video today, or in my case tonight. Um, this is my shopping haul video, and I probably filmed it seven, maybe even eight times. I don't know. I lost track. Um, I've either said something wrong, camera shut off, I didn't have enough room in my phone for the, the video, or I said something and didn't put it in the video, like the last one I just filmed. So let's see if I can do this the right way. I went to Hollister Forever 21, Bath and Body, Wet Seal, Sears, and Tivana. Now, let's see if I can get all that stuff into this video and not long and boring. Alright, so I'm going to start off with Wet Seal. It's got pouring up most of my stuff. I went to the mall Saturday and just kind of went a little crazy. I got some new clothes, some other non-clothes items, but I did get rid of a lot of stuff. I had this thing where my mom said, for everything new item you buy, donate one. So for every piece of clothing here, I donated one. So I got just a basic white t-shirt. I don't have any, just basic white. So you wear that with a pair of jeans and Uggs, you're good to go. My next items, there are two of the same, just in different colors. This is like a mint green. It'll probably show up teal on camera. But it's the lace up front with the lace in the back with the little zipper detail. I thought that was really cute. And I got it in that color. And the black, same thing. Then I got two basic long sleeve t-shirts. One in purple. Tangled, one in purple, and one in this dark charcoal gray with black stripes. And then the last one from them is kind of like a gray green olive colored long shirt. You can wear with leggings or even jeans if you want to. Um, but it's just the basic front, and then it's got the swoop backing, which I thought was nice. Most of my t-shirts you know, go all the way up, so that was pretty different. Then I went to Sears. Most of the stuff is from the Bongo collection. Because Sears carry, besides their name brand stuff, Sears, they have other companies. They don't have their like, own retail store. So this is just a thin red sweater. Um, dress it up, dress it down, you know, jeans and a cami or an A-line skirt with a laced cami. You know, just either way, looks really nice. And I got another buttoned down sweater. It's thick, so we're like a tank top or a t-shirt with it. But it was really cute. I got it, besides the fact that it was really warm. It had these cute little pockets, not like big, but for like a tissues or lip gloss or chapstick for the winter weather. These little fake crystals on here. Excuse me. Um, but I thought it was a nice little detail on it. And dressed that up, definitely. Then, I'm surprised I didn't own, I didn't own a pair of skinny jeans. So, I got these. Most of my jeans are light wash and boot cut, so they go over my shoes instead of in. And it's hard to stuff them in because they're kind of thick and they were bunching up and it was just personally annoying. So I just got a basic skinny jean. Has the little crystal bejewel up front and on the back pocket. Then, from Forever 21, I wanted to get another long shirt, shirt, oh boy, um, it's been a long night, um, for my uh, leggings, you know, because you don't want your derriere hanging out, so, even though, depending on what you wear, it can, but, so it's just a basic t-shirt feeling up front, then it's got the sheer in the back, you can see it where it's, because it's a little longer, so you can see that it's, you know, sheer. So I thought that would be nice with some pair of like, black lats. The non-clothing item I got from them, they were having their wipes, makeup wipes, three for ten. So I was like, that's great. So I got two for myself. I gave one away. This one's the green tea. And this is the aloe extract. I have dry skin sometimes. Sometimes they're really oily. So I got those two things. So the green tea's actually been working. I've used it a few times. So that's great. And this is a little like band 
over for like my ears when it's cold because I don't really personally like the hats, winter hats, they make my hair messy. I like the fashion statement hats but not the winter hats. So this is a basic black t-shirt with the Chanel logo on it. I thought that was so cute. It's got the clear crystals here and then the black ones here. I just thought that was really, really nice. You know, throw it on with a pair of jeans, a pair of Uggs or flats, and you're good to go. Okay, um, okay, I mentioned Hollister, and I forgot to mention this. I mentioned it, but didn't show it. So let's remember to do it now, right? So this is another sweater, lots of sweaters, but it's thicker than the red one, but not as thick as the gray one. So this is just a basic light gray sweater from Hollister. It has this little, like, they're not like straight lines, they're on like an angle, so it gives you a little waist, which is really nice. Sorry for the background noise, my brother's next door to me, so he's probably playing a video game. Um, but Hollister was having a sale, 50% off sweaters, t-shirts, and hoodies, I think. Not sure about the hoodie part. But it was really nice, I was like, okay, 50% off, that was great. Normally I don't buy Hollister because it can be a little out of price range, also, I'm, normally I didn't think i fit in them, but I got in medium. Because sweaters, I guess, make them a little bigger. Normally, I'm a large because I have broad shoulders. This is really nice. Um, and then I went to the dollar store that was in the mall. They were selling the Beanie Beanies. Now, obviously, Beanie Beanies aren't a dollar. It was four, but it's not that bad. He's cute. Normally, other places, they think sell them for like six. But don't quote me on that either. Um, but he's cute. I love pandas. And he has these big, green, bulgy eyes. And I just thought he was so cute. Just look how tiny he is adorable. Anyway, okay. I am a bath and bodies freak. Maybe I can do that as the next video. My entire bath and bodies collection. Some of this stuff has like this much in it, but I still hold on to it because it's there. Some of it has like this much, and some of them are just brand new. <coughs> um, so I went and I got their three wick candles. Um, I got two of them. They're two for twenty-two normally. Well, actually, not normally. Normally, they're twenty dollars. I got two for twenty-two because they're having them on sale. I think Wednesday or Thursday. I got two more, so I went back and got two more. <laughs> um, so this is in good-natured Christmas, like Christmas in a jar, I think. It has a white birch smoked vanilla bean. And hint of musk. I smell nutmeg in there, but that just might be in my nose. And then I got the classic vanilla bean Noel. Can't go wrong with that. So I thought that was nice. Then my last thing was from Tivana, which I've been saying wrong. Don't know why. I'm not even going to tell you what I was saying. So I got, they were having a sale, their holiday favorite tea collection. Um, the four four that came in here were the pumpkin spice, the white chocolate peppermint, yes, then the spiced apple cider, orange chocolate, orange chocolate sweet spice. I'm not so sure about that one, orange and chocolate. Who knows, I might actually find out that I love it. <clears throat> this is the size of the bag. Whoops. <laughs> this is the size of the bag. Um, I'm not too sure how long to steep these for. If you guys wouldn't mind like leaving comments below of how I am. Like, I mean, it says on the back like how to brew the white teas and the green teas and the herbal teas and the black teas. But I'm not sure out of the names that I just said what kind of teas they are. You would have thought Common Sense made to ask them. But obviously I didn't have any Saturday. So I'm not sure. Please let me know. That would be a really great help. But because they're all natural, not like the ground up teas, like for the Lipton, it's the pure, like, pumpkin spices. And, like, it's all the pure leaves. So I bought the bags from them. They were not sure how much. But there's these little thin bags. And I mean, like, they're really thin. Like, you can see my fingers. You would think they'd be a little thicker because they are you are putting them in hot water. And I tried one the other night and it kind of fell apart. So like the stuff was going out of the bag. I was like, well, that's not supposed to happen. So I'm not a big fan of these. 
but I was gonna buy them once those ran out because there's only like a hundred in the box I bought uh, this little squeeze it and you put the tea grounds in here and it's a little like sifter filter so you put the tea in here and you just let it sit in there but like I said I'm not sure how long I'm supposed to let it sit in here please let me know um, let me make sure that yep okay so that is everything for this video I hope you guys enjoyed it I know I did make me because I like you know just so many things my video before this was my elf cosmetic haul um, and then before that was my introductory video if you go guys go watch those and leave your comments give them a big thumbs up as, as well as this one subscribe to my channel um, I'm trying to do weekly vlogs maybe even twice a week because I really don't have much to do besides working so you know I thought I'd share what's going on in my life what I'm doing so I hope you guys like it enjoyed it give it a big thumbs up leave your comments below about the tea um, any other stuff I've shown here if they're still on sale or if I can find them on the website I can leave the links below as well also I'm gonna leave the links to my social media websites my Instagram and my Facebook my, not my Facebook my Instagram and my Twitter you can follow me on both of those I put it um, pictures of this stuff stuff I bought a couple days ago and other things so definitely check that stuff out um, I'd be really grateful for that but definitely subscribe to my channel um, that is it so hope you guys have a wonderful night wonderful day wherever you are watching this and I will see you next time